Name and badge number. My name is Officer Aguirre. My badge Officer number is Aguirre. 3956. Yeah. Why don't you have a badge on you? Why don't you even have your nameplate? I do. It says police right here. No, that does not okay. say Officer Aguirre okay. or your Listen, badge number. You, you can try to nickel and dime all you want. I have not tried to contact you. This is Officer Aguirre of the Fort Worth Police Department, and he just got caught driving like an asshole. Welcome back to my channel, folks. Today's video is coming to us from this channel, John Doe. Be sure to head on over to his channel and give him credit for this video. So this video was posted a couple days ago, and I guess this guy followed Officer Aguirre around for a little bit after he saw that he was making multiple traffic infractions by not using his turn signal when switching lanes and not using his turn signal as stops or stop lights. Now, not using your turn signals as stop signs is pretty dangerous. Dangerous. You could confuse a driver thinking that you're going to go straight and then you turn and then you're going to cause an accident. But I want you to pay attention to the irony in this officer's response. He doesn't even take responsibility for his actions. Rather, he's trying to deflect and he wants to say that this guy is being petty, yet that's a little hypocritical coming from him that enforces these petty traffic codes. But enough of that. Let's jump into the video and break a few things down. I want what your I name. For you? I want your name. You well, obviously have an attitude to just roll I, up the I window. Do have, and blow I do me not off. have an attitude, sir. Then why'd you roll up the window to blow me off when I told no. you you were in the wrong? You've, okay. you've, you've turned multiple okay. times and did not use Wait any blinkers whatsoever. You, you didn't even use the blinker right here at this turn. I, I, okay. Above the law, are we? No. Above not, the law, are we? Why are you shaking so bad? Because I'm bipolar and okay. ultimately I'm tired right. of authorities abusing their power. I, you're supposed to sir, set an example you're, you're in multiple times. Okay. And you're following me and I'm not going to have you follow me to my Why house. is that? Do you understand? Why is that? I don't know who you are or what your intentions are. But I'm, I'm not going to I want your name and number. Name and badge number. My name is Officer Aguirre. My badge Officer number is 3956. Yeah. Why don't you have a badge on you? Why don't you even have your nameplate? I do. It says police right here. No, that does not okay. say Officer Aguirre okay. or your Listen, badge number. You, you can try to nickel and dime all you want. I have not tried to contact you. you no, you're not because you're not you're, in your jurisdiction. Okay. But again, you're changing yeah. lanes multiple times as a police officer. Okay. And if I'd have done it, I'd got pulled over and gotten Sir, tickets and shit. I don't, I don't know what your past history is. You don't need to know that. Your, my past your, history is what irrelevant. What you're so angry about. My pers no, it Look, doesn't matter. I, I you're I not above the law. I, 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 you're I not above the law. I didn't claim that. It's not do as I say, I didn't, not didn't as I that. do. I don't stop you changed for that. multiple Listen. times, multiple times, not using a blinker, okay. even at this turn right here, okay. and you this, didn't use a right blinker. Here, this right here is a, is a parking lot. Parking this lot is, or not, a, you still not need a, a blinker. Okay. You still need a blinker. So did, did you see me use my blinker multiple times also? Now, come on. You have to either be stupid, dumb, or just completely oblivious to the fact that you said, I don't know if you're trying to nickel and dime. So, would you not agree, Officer Aguirre, that police who enforce traffic infractions as petty as turn signals would not be trying to nickel and dime the American people? I want you to pay attention to Officer Aguirre's body language, the way he is being held accountable but not taking responsibility for his actions and instead is deflecting and trying to make this guy seem out to be some kind of weirdo. Now, don't get me wrong. If I was recording this officer, I probably wouldn't have admitted to the fact that I have bipolar disorder. But hey, teach their own. Anybody can say whatever they want. The petty nature that police officers have when enforcing traffic codes is the one that Officer Aguirre is getting frustrated with right here. Police do this all the time. Not only that, but they also break traffic codes all the time as well. I mean, you just have to drive down any public street with a stoplight and you'll see that some of the times they'll run their lights and run a red light. Now they do this because they think that's their job and that's what it entails and they won't even be responding to an emergency. In reality, the only time they're allowed to commit traffic infractions like this is during a code 3 emergency with their lights on and people will start moving out of the way for them. But just like everything else that they're allowed to do, police abuse this by running red lights, running stop signs and causing accidents. And if you don't believe me that police cause accidents, I would encourage you to look up how many times police get in car accidents with other individuals and them being the cause of it. Outside oh, off of this main road, yeah. Did you see it? On 174. Okay. That's why I stopped right. you and rolled your window down. You stopped me? Are you a yeah. police officer? No, I didn't stop okay. you, but I it had you roll down your like window. You you it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what it looks here. like. Yeah. It doesn't matter what it looks like. I'm not pertaining or claiming to be a police officer. Okay. Not once did I say me. I'm a You're police officer. Where I stop? 
right. Okay, yeah. You're, you're trying okay. to. And what's the problem? Right. Do you need to call your supervisor? No, I don't need a supervisor. Then what's your problem? No, I Other don't than have the a fact problem. you're not doing what so, you should be doing. Okay. I will admit I'm not perfect. And neither are you. Mm -hmm. Neither is anybody else out here. Uh -huh. Okay. I don't have a problem with you or what you're doing or what you're You just have a problem, else. then I'm calling you out no, on your shit. I, I have no problem. That's why you rolled up your window to blow me off. I thought that you had an emergency, sir. No, I could tell bullshit. that you were rolling down your window bullshit. trying to get my attention. Okay, so you right? thought I had an emergency. You don't have So an you emergency. wanted to listen to me, and then when you realized it wasn't an emergency, you blew me off and blew up your no, fucking window. The, the light changed, sir. No, and, you blew. You we, rolled we your window up traffic. before the light even changed. Did I? Yeah, you're okay. so full of shit, dude. All right. Yeah. Do you have video of that? <laughs> if I had, it would even oh, make okay. you even okay. worse. Okay. But I don't drive well, around not, with my I'm, camera I'm not, on. I'm not going to argue with you. Okay, so just but get I'm, back in your cruiser. Right. Keep violating traffic standards and st traffic laws that y'all are supposed to be imposing others right. to be doing sorry, that you make money I'm off sorry of. For, I don't make any money. I don't need your sorry. I'm sorry. I don't for need your apologies. To you, I don't need your I'm apologies. Sorry for whatever's got I don't you need all your apologies. Riled up. I, as okay. a concerned citizen, want to see the okay. police department mm -hmm. do as they're supposed to do. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. I appreciate your good citizenship. You, it ain't even all about right. that. All right. Okay. Set an example. Thank you. Yeah. Good afternoon. Good yeah. Afternoon. I find it quite hilarious that Officer Aguirre has a problem being followed home, yet his job entails following people home, right? I mean, that's what he would say, that sometimes it requires him to follow someone to their residence to conduct an investigation. Well, guess what? This guy's conducting an investigation on you being a shit driver. The officer doesn't care, right? He thinks that he's above the law and can just do whatever he wants, and that's why he has a problem with this guy calling him out. Not only that, but if this guy's claims are true and this guy just tried to approach him, and he just rolled his window up, that just proves that you are childish and cannot be told things. So now I pose this question, why is it okay when officers do this to extort people for revenue for city, county, local governments and such, but not hold themselves accountable when they are getting pressed like this? It needs to be, this needs to be more common practice, not to mess with anybody individually, but to give back to police what they do to us. Police accountability can be major or it could be minor. You could be recording an officer absolutely beating the shit out of somebody 